hey, coffee lovers, come on in. Yeah, welcome. <laughs> All right, hey, coffee lovers, tomorrow is National Coffee Day. Yeah, and the new Parisi Cafe in Union Station is just one of many shops offering free cups of joe tomorrow. That's right, free. Mm -hmm. They're celebrated. They celebrated their grand opening on September 1st. Kate Blackman is Hi. the cafe manager of the new Parisi Cafe. Yeah. She is also a barista who is here showing us how to make this brand new mm -hmm. trend yeah, what in is coffee this? making. How are you doing this? So this is pour over coffee and um, basically it's an individually by the, by the cup. Um, you come in, you pick your bean, we grind it right there, get you set up and um, it's just a really great way to enjoy a fresh cup of coffee. Why would I want that particular kind of coffee than just, you know, one that I'm used to? Um, freshness, freshness is my first argument um, because obviously if you're getting it made right in front of you, uh, you get to enjoy the smells of it and watch somebody kind of engaged in the process of making you a cup. And I think also being able to choose what bean you want every time is a lot of fun. Huh. Um, this method produces just a really clean, really sweet cup of coffee. Mm -hmm. And you said that this is something that's really taken over on the coasts and then it's starting to make its way now into the Midwest. Right. Yeah, yeah, you'll see this um, all over the place in California and New York and um, a lot of places in Chicago and uh, we're really excited to be uh -huh. Um, be doing yeah. it here. Hey, folks, it's coast approved. Now it's here in the Midwest. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, Scotty, yeah. Yeah, tell us about uh, coffee in general. Um, you're obviously in the business. Um, right. Are you noticing more and more people uh, going to specialty coffees or, or different kinds than just what your mom and dad would drink at home? Yeah, I think specialty coffee's changed a lot in the last 10 years. I think we've found that as more people discover that there's uniqueness in the flavors of coffees, like wines, there's specialties and origins and tastes and flavors, they're usually choosing to find something that's a little more exact to their palate and what they like. And real quickly, Scott, you guys don't just offer coffee anymore, right. it's also food as well. Exactly. We're probably one of the few coffee shops in town that has an executive chef on staff. So, I mean, wow. we basically prepare lunch uh, and breakfast and brunch items every day. Uh, we're open 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. Monday through Friday and mm. then 8 to 6 on the weekends. Yeah. And that toffee is delicious. It is yes, delicious. It is yeah, fabulous. absolutely. It's perfect with the coffee. Yeah. All right, so again, the Parisi Cafe, just one of many shops around our metro area serving free coffee in honor of National Coffee Day, Thursday, September 29th, tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And it's at their new Union Station shop from 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. Great. Yeah. All right, guys, thank you. And, and the coffee is very good. Excellent. Yes, Thanks. I love it. I'm a huge coffee drinker. Uh, Brett Anthony, you're a big coffee drinker with me in the mornings as well.